Hey dear sis, welcome back to Pokemon Sword. And before we go over that giant hill, I'm gonna do four surprise trades. So I was messing with surprise trades in between uh, videos. So this is what I got from other people. So I got a level 56 Gyarados from Japan. I got a Chinese Drillbur level one. I got, <laughs> I still get over this one. Danny DeVito. <laughs> I'm crying. Level 60. I love Danny DeVito. I'm not getting rid of him. I got a Drapey, which I get a lot of Drapeys from Japan. I don't know why I get so many Drapeys from Japan when I surprise trade at night. So this is probably like the gazillion one I've gotten. Uh, the Vanellix, which I think I put in here <clears throat> and I need to trade. So I'm probably five. We're going to do five surprise trades. I got an Aracuda. It's level one. I have a Drampa that's level one, but I didn't have one before, so I appreciate it. So let's get rid of the Vanillix, because I'm pretty certain this is the one that I, did I catch this? I think I caught it, because I don't want it. So we're selecting Vanillix. So, and I just want to show you the next screen. This is what happened to me when I went over the hill. So it's a really nice scenic view. Kind of reminds me of Victory Road when you go through the long winding road. Even though there is no Victory Road in this game. But you start walking and the music starts playing. I think it starts playing once you're out of the snow. Hold on. Wow, excuse me. Well, it was starting to play. Because I got up to here. Maybe it didn't. Maybe it didn't. I don't know. Okay, well, whatever. We're going to investigate it later. So I'm doing the trades on camera because I just want to see if this is going to increase my chances of getting something good. And as I was going to say before, I don't like trading... A stupid Pokemon. Ooh, a Cloyster. I have one though. But hey, something different, something you don't typically see. So I don't, I don't like giving out like stupid ones. And like, like I said in the last video, when you're first starting off, yeah, you have nothing to really trade. Um, but once you've played the game, which most people start playing the game, I want something better. So this is a good one. I, it's a high level Pokemon. It's usable. The Dynamax level is pretty good. Um, I don't care anything about its stats. I just I just care about the fact that it's not a stupid level one drapey. So with that, we're gonna do our three Pichus, and I like to and these Pichus are the ones that I've um, I've breed like through eggs. So I haven't seen any yet, and so basically for anybody who uh, needs it for their Pokédex, I'm giving it to them. If somebody needs a uh, English Pichu for shiny trades, then that's that may be helpful. Or just to evolve it into a Pikachu and get a Raichu, even though you can get Pikachu pretty, pretty early on, and you can do the egg thing pretty early on. But some maybe somebody doesn't care about the whole egg trade, so that's why I'm considering Pichu's a good trade. At least to me. I don't know if it actually is or isn't, but you can't normally catch it. So unless you're going through the extra methods of breeding it, you're not going to really get it. So I figured, why not? Pichus are nice. P I think Pichus are a nice, friendly uh, Pokemon to send over. It's not a typical Pokemon to send over. So I also like trading like regional Pokemon. I did trade, I got one Corsola. And I like had a whole bunch of eggs for it. And I traded a whole bunch of those away. Just because they were regional. <gasps> yeah, so, yeah, the Slowpoke. Yes. I was actually thinking about uh, egging my Slowpoke. You don't want your, your Slowpoke? Aw, I love my Slowpoke. I love Lemonade. Lemonade. I need to get him higher up. So it's a level one, but it's from Spain. So I have a chance to uh, get a shiny, probably. All right, our second Pichu. Here we go. Okay. Second Pichu, we're sending it to Japan. 
So again, maybe that might be really helpful for the shiny. Shiny trade. See, a Dreepy! Why does Japan send Dreepies? What is the point of the Dreepies? I don't, I don't get your guys' fascination with them. If I trade Pokemon, like, in the middle of the day, I get a whole bunch of Eevees instead, and I'm like, why? Level one, level one, the only difference is the attacks. Wow, so great, I love it. I hate it. All right, Pichu number three. Please do not disappoint. Okay, Pichu number three is going to Cory in the White House, or Cory in the House. All right, what is Cory? What's Cory gonna give me? Aww, you gave me a starter Pokemon, Sobble. Actually, I wonder if he may be doing that challenge of surprise trade, like the first six Pokemon you get. Uh, I wonder if that's the case. That's actually pretty interesting. If if so, because it's well, maybe not. It's level one, so they obviously egged it. Uh, I don't care for a Sobble. I have a Sobble. Mine evolved. All right. So here it is, moment of truth. I'm sending out a level 58 ditto, and I'm hoping it's gonna go to somebody who's not English speaking to, again, help with um, shiny trades, like maybe they, or shiny eggs, like maybe they can get a, a shiny ditto, I don't know, we'll find out. Uh, I probably went to Chris. Okay, Chris, well I hope you appreciate the ditto. I really hope you appreciate the ditto. Ditto! And a Vulpix. I already have a Vulpix and I have a Ninetales. But it's a Japanese Vulpix. I don't think that's Vulpix's name in Japanese, so I think somebody nicknamed it. Alright, so we're gonna check out that Vulpix just to see what we got. Level 24 and it's from Japan. Oh, well, I don't particularly care to have it. So we're gonna leave it on Newcomers and we're... I thought there was more. But, nope, we're literally right here in the city, so there's probably going to be a cutscene. So we're in Windon. Windon? I hope that's how I, you say it. It seems like there's a little path straight up. Oh, there's Hop. Wow, it's like a carnival. This is supposed to be like London. Yeah, this is totally London. <laughs> Wow! Pretty interesting. They even have like the London Eye. I like that stadium. I like the fact that it's like a rose. They have concession stands. Do I have to battle? I hope I don't have to battle Hop right here now. I hope I can battle him later. Alright, White on City! This is the place where I become a legend at last! You get it, don't you mate? After all, I'm about to become the new champion of Galar region. That's it, I'm heading straight for Wyanon Stadium. Don't waste too much time, Sora. You should head there yourself. See ya. Oh, it's straight to the right. Well, guess what, Hop? You don't know me, and we're supposed to be childhood friends. Ha! I have to shop. I have to look. I have to do everything. All right. Wow, this Pokemon is huge. What does your dad say? I'm glad we live in a world where I can coexist with a giant Pokemon like this. Well, I'm glad too, I guess. Good day. Alright. Why is this all red? Oh, little kid. Yay, I'm a Charizard! <laughs> go, live your dreams! You should join that guy in the woods! Okay, maybe when you're older, go join the guy in the woods. Welcome to the mo modern city, ooh, of Windon. This blooming metropolis was designed and developed by our very own Chairman Rose. Oh, that explains the Rose uh, mo motifs. But if this is supposed to be based off of London. London isn't modern. London's an old, ancient city. Mama Mime. This Mr. Mime's name is Marcel. It's really amazing. Gosh, you're still kind of creepy. I'm taking as many pictures as I can. They're like little slices of time. I agree. I like that. I feel like my Pokemon always smiles when we take photos together. Well, yeah, it's, it's a vanilla, vanillix. If you're sitting, you have to stand up eventually, right? In the same way, even if you're defeated, sooner or later you'll get back on your feet. I mean, that's true. You can tell Leon absolutely loves the battle. Just look at his smile. 
Pokemon trainers are really amazing. I mean, they can compete on the world stage. Yeah, being on stage and having to perform, even if it's like a battle, it is kind of nerve-wracking at times. Because I remember all the times I had to be on stage in high school, and I'm like, huh. If a trainer I'm cheering for loses, it really brings me down, as if I'm the one who lost. Even if the match itself has nothing to do with me, that's what it means to be a supporter. I mean, yeah. It must be nice to be a supporter of someone. It's not easy to be so dedicated to a stranger. But I wonder how that works. I wonder how you can... Hmm. Better to raise it from a Charmander. You'll form a stronger bond that way. I'm gonna join a gym challenge too with my very own Charizard! Charizard! Okay, we're gonna go into Pokemon Center so we can heal. Okay, so let's talk to you. I'd like to invite some of the fine trainers flourishing in Galar back to my own region. But you don't say which region you're from. I came all the way from Unova, so I might as well give everything a try, including Poke Jobs. There's a Rotom in that machine. Oh yeah, you guys aren't used to that. That's okay. You'll adapt. You just, just become the science man. Okay, I don't know where to go. I trained myself together with my Pokemon. Because if I go that way, I'm going towards the stadium, and I don't want to do that. Alright. This looks like a giant shopping center. Is it? Oh, wow. Or train station. Train station. I want to do an entire loop of the Galar region. What better way to start than the Ferris wheel? Oh, is this like a Ferris wheel? A Ferris wheel, but I'm afraid of heights! Nothing here. Okay. Wydon is quite massive, so it can be a, a frightful headache to find your way around. Best to use the monorail or ring up a flying taxi. Pokemart, I don't need to buy anything. You're doing such a good job, little buddy. Okay, guess we can't read. Okay, guess we can't read? Certain Pokemon species love the train rails. They can cause rather amusing trouble at times. So this is the rail. None. None. We're not going to any. Not yet. Nothing here. <clears throat> oh, soda machines. Uh, I'm good. I don't need it. Yeah, you weren't thirsty. Wait, yeah, you weren't thirsty anyway. Oh, gosh. We get heaps of tourists here in White On, so I change up the menu to cater to their tastes. I mean, that's a good strategy. You get so caught up in the action of the matches when you're in the stadium that you forget to eat. I mean, yeah, you can forget to eat. It's pretty easy. My Pokemon loves music more than just about anything else. When they hear anything with a sick beat, they can't stand still. They're off like a shot. Yeah. What about you, lady? So according to this, you can't reach Rose Tower unless you take the monorail. What do you say? You can see one of Wydon's famous monorail platforms right this way. The monorail goes round and round the city. It's a dizzying delight. The Rose Wydon Stadium. Okay, so it's a transport. So I think I'm good because I don't want to explore that deep. You know, I just want to look around. We're just getting a feel for the place, okay? All right. I always bring up the I always bring up the weather when meeting new people. I mean, it's a good conversation starter. Good day. Hello. Yeah, I got tickets for front row seats in the stadium. Come on over. Let's open. Ooh, yes. Max revive. That is very handy. I'm pretending to be the Lynx. I'm pretending to be Phalanx too! And what about you, sir? I can't even keep my siblings under control. I don't think I could handle raising six Pokemon. Your, your siblings are fine. Champions match. How many companies does Mr. Rose own again? Mr. Rowe used the power of his company to turn this city into a tourist spot but without ruining the historical buildings and street. Oh, is this a battle cafe? Yes! Battle cafes! Well, you see, we depend entirely on Pokemon that come to us for the Poke jobs at our hotel. 
I can do jobs that Pokemon can't do. For example, uh, I don't know, but I'm sure there's something I can do. I'm training so that I can become huge too and help defeat Dy Dynamax Pokemon. Maybe I should go and have some max raid battles in the wild area before the matches start. You're cute. You okay, boy? Palpitoad, you've had too much to eat. Are you okay? Aw, it's sick. So many people in the city. I got lost, but thank goodness for the flying taxi. Even if you get lost, it's fun to reach your destination by using the town map. Cherub. Thank you. All right. We're having a wonderful tour, aren't we, sis? How about you guys? Me, I've been a fan of Leon since he first participated in the gym challenge. Oh, so whoops, I didn't mean that, I want your sister. Anybody can say things like, I've been a fan for a long time, or I've watched all his matches. It doesn't prove that you're a real fan. I mean, in terms of realness? I mean, I don't know, you can be whatever kind of fan you wanna be. I mean, you decide for yourself if you're a quote unquote real fan, but it really doesn't matter. If you like the person and you enjoy what they do, then that's really all that matters. All right, can I can I go in? Yes, yes, yes! I really want a kid-sized version of Leon's cape, but they're all sold out. Everyone should wear costumes, then we'd all be best friends with our Pokemon. I wonder if they have any costumes that look more like the Pokemon they're supposed to be. So I'm gonna hold off on here because if there's a clothing store, there may be a salon, yes! Let me talk to you. Marnie gave me her autograph just now, it's my treasure. Yes, okay, salon. Oh, no, 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 we're not doing, not, not yet, not yet. Each Pokemon has a different type of fur, so I've got a lot to learn. I can't remember where I saw them, but I'm debating whether I should go with a hairstyle like a sword or a shield. Weird. If you win, it's time for a makeover. If you lose, it's also time for a makeover. It's all about your mood. Okay, so we're gonna pause here, because I'm gonna get my hair done, and probably my makeup, and I'm gonna buy some clothes, and you're gonna see a magical new transformation of another goth version. Just so you don't know what kind of goth am I gonna be. Am I gonna be the pink and black, or am I gonna be the blue and black? You don't know, so we'll find out. Okay, well I changed, but you're not really gonna see it up close until it does something like this. I uh, well, we're not going that way. So if I get it, if I'm able to get like an actual good close up, then I will show you. Don't listen to my sister; she's just making things up. Hey, isn't that you, sis? <laughs> isn't this a huge Ferris wheel? It's known as the Galar Hurricane. But she's not making anything up. It's probably true. Bridges connect two separate things, so they can be seen as symbols of friendship too. I guess, if you put it like that. Oh my goodness. Lots of things, so we're gonna collect you. A big nugget. If you want to get around wide on, you've come to the right flying taxi, governor. Oh, governor, where would you like to go? No thanks, let me know, I appreciate it. What are you guys? This kind of Pokemon carried us all the way to the hotel. You've got to give it to Mudsdale. I've never seen it overloaded in my hand before writing it. Oh, is this like parking for Pokemon? That's really cute, actually. So this is the hotel. Pokemon that work in the hotels and Pokemon that participate in battles. They all have a sharp look to them. When I see a truly amazing battle, it fills my whole body of energy. I've got all the respect in the world for trainers who can put on matches like that. Mm, okay, so it looks like it's a hotel, so let's go ahead in. Wow, double doors. Okay, so since we're inside a nice fancy hotel, this is me! This is what I look like! So I decided to go with long hair again, so I did long black hair, because I've never had black hair in my whole life. So I figured why not, no bangs, did something completely different, and I'm wearing black and green this time around. So I'm a black and green goth, and black and green are my top two favorite colors actually so which you already know that but I'm just saying for anybody out there <laughs> who's listening in I don't know but green's my favorite color black's my second favorite color and my third favorite color is pink so I this is my goth look I was looking at the hat and I should have made a black but I thought that was too much black I needed some more splashes of color um, yeah so I just wanted to dress I just wanted to dress all gothy for my girlfriend Marnie of course 
So let's go ahead and walk around. We had a Professor Layton incident last time. A celebrity watching any match is sure to get everyone interested. I was invited by Marco Cosmos to come watch the matches. I have no idea who that is. Do I have to assume he's famous? Being a doorman is a lot of work. It doesn't matter how many people come and go, mistakes are unacceptable. That's why we have Pokemon helping us out too. But Pokemon also can make mistakes. They're not perfect. No Pokemon is perfect. Um, what about this side? I know my wife is complaining, but she actually loves traveling with her Pokemon. I came to Galar on my bribery instead of my private jet, but I must admit it was a little tiring. Okay, well, all right. Welcome to the Rose of the Rondelands. We pride ourselves on offering five-star service as beloved throughout the world. It's important to always be smiling. My legs are feeling a bit swollen, though. That's what I don't understand is jobs like these, why can't they have chairs? Why not? What's? Why can't they just not have chairs if they're standing the whole time? I don't get that. I'm a professional concierge. I'm more than happy to assist Pokemon, even if we don't speak the same language. Ooh, a guest book. Nope. And I can't... I literally can't go anywhere else? Welcome. Elevator, elevator. Nope. Um, so this is just a fancy looking place. Okay. Unless it changes later. Unless we get to actually... Nope, don't do that. Don't do that either. I was trying to get on the bike. Yeah, it's, this place is really huge. I can change my job or even my home, but I can't change my favorite challenger or my favorite Pokemon. Um, I mean, you can totally change. You don't, you can't say never say never air balloon. And it'll burst. Okay. And we got our telephone booths. Oh, I didn't mean to, oh, I clicked A without doing anything. I didn't mean to do that. Oh, it's going to go into a cutscene. It's going to go into a cutscene. Okay, nope. Uh, okay, so it only takes me, takes me to those two places, so there's no way to really get there. Okay, then we're gonna say no. Alright, another Pokemon Center, because this place is huge. Uh, we're gonna heal our Pokemon anyway. Just to kind of establish the fact that, yes, we are here, this is what we're doing. Blah, 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 blah. Okay, thank you. Yep. Alright. Loads of people come for the finals, so they make a big fuss about security. And I'd really been hoping to get off duty to see a match for myself. You can't help work. If you hang around Pokemon Centers enough, you might be lucky enough to meet a challenger. I'm planning to have that old man in Sir Chester teach me the move Draco Meter. Oh yeah. I had one of my Pokemon learn it. It was okay. <laughs> It was okay. Trash cans. Nothing. What is this? White on stadium. If you want to get around... Oh, yep. No thanks. Okay, so they're there. I'm not going to go into the stadium just yet. I want to enter it as a challenger. Okay, well I feel that. Hold on. Is there any... There was a bunch of houses over there, so I'm not really going to get much closer than this. Today's weather is perfect for a match. I mean, I say that for any weather, and the stadium has a roof, but still. I came looking for rare league cards, but they're all sold out. Get your official merchandise here. We also have league cards. I can't buy anything. I wasn't thirsty at all, but all these juices look so good now that I feel parched. Challengers are just too amazing. Any mistake they make is seen by tens of thousands of fans, but the challengers just keep on battling as if it were nothing. They must all have nerves as steel. Would you care for some Pokemon snacks or Pokemon drinks? He didn't sell me anything, thanks. He says he likes someone who's fun to be with, even when they're eating their usual food. I think the reason why we feel restaurant food is so much better than normal food is because of the novelty of it all. Alright, you two knuckleheads. We'll show you the full power of Team Yell. We're gonna stay out of trouble this time. I mean, we want to watch the matches, too. Kind of funny. But, I mean, they're, they're normal people. Cantonians and Galarians both seem to like waiting in lines. <laughs> everybody in the world watches the same match. That means everybody in the world can talk to each other about that same match. Great matches will always be remembered by the crowd. Okay. You never know the weather until you wake up. You never know who will win until it's done. 
I wonder how many houses will fit inside White on Stadium. Probably a lot of houses. Oh, it's a Growlithe and a little kid! Growlithe, I'll race you to the stadium! We can just walk to the stadium, but challengers have to win if they want to reach it. I cross the bridge one way feeling anticipation for the match I'm going to watch, and then I cross the bridge the other way feeling excited after seeing an amazing match. Well, yeah. Again, understandable. Okay, this is this hidden pathway. There was somebody on this, wasn't there? Oh, that's pretty. So many people, it's a little intimidating. Oh, I feel ya. Am I, are these, like, the streets of gold? You gotta see how the best survive. Do -do -do. Yeah, here's another one. A blob of black sludge. Oh, wow. Mm. Okay, that was useless. Okay, let's enter some houses. Sureshimasu. <laughs> Why are you on top of the bookcase? Kid, you're Pokemon. Halucha, that's it. That's the ticket. Maybe we can do a bit sharper next time? Uh, okay. You're, you're a weirdo, kid. I would not let my Pokemon crawl upon my cabinet. No siree. Well, now, what's this? I see you have a Rotom phone and a bike. That means you must already know that the Rotom, Pokemon Rotom absolutely loves to jump into all sorts of different motors. If you want to find out how a Rotom enters motors, then try my, try to best my very own Rotom. Sure. Prepare to be confounded by all the various forms of my dear Rotom. Oh yeah, I heard Rotoms have different forms. League staff. It's a little trike. Wow, so cute. I need to snipe you. It's not going to be very effective, but I'm still 40 levels higher than you. It's fine, just don't kill me. I'll use light screen, okay. Okay, we're still going to do it. I should be fine, it's gonna make it weaker, but if it did more than half damage, I, I feel confident. Yep. Ha! Nice try. Nope. Yep, there's the, the vacuum. Still, we're gonna snipe ya. I know it's not gonna be effective, but I don't care. Oh, it almost did half. Volt switch, that's not good. Yeah, it's not good, okay. And another Rotom. Okay. Oh, super effective, then yes, we're doing it. It's probably fire and electric. Okay, that's good. So, the other one that's gonna come out, I'm gonna soak it. It's probably my best move. I'm not gonna switch. We're gonna soak it so its attack doesn't hurt me again. It'll still be not very effective, but that way I don't die. Yeah. Thank you, Liza! The light screen wore off. Good. So we're gonna do water pulse. Again, not very effective, but still. It's still gonna take me probably another extra attack. Oh, crit hit. Or not a crit hit. I thought it was a crit hit. Okay. See, so the, the soak just is so helpful. Nice try, Isaac. But Rotom changes its types and moves when it changes its form. Yeah, I could tell. You defeated every one of my Rotom. You should be able to put this catalog to good use. A Rotom catalog. Okay. Key items. If you use the Rotom catalog, it will let the Rotom enter all sorts of home appliances. can get out. Interesting. Thanks. That's actually really helpful. All right. Next house. 
It can seem a wee bit harsh having it broadcast for all to see whether you've won or lost, but it's also a fine chance to understand exactly how strong you are if you care. Bonsly, I have you, and I don't know your name because it's in Japanese, but I have you as well. I'll turn on your TV, lady. You're welcome. Aren't I such a good civilian breaking into your house? Alright. Who's in here? Okay, an artiste. I'm searching for a frost moth. You wouldn't happen to have one, would you? Trade it for my drill. I don't know. I don't have it. Thus, my answer is no. The next house. Hmm, it seems I've run out of time to reread all the books I've got on my shelves, but even looking over their spines and reading the titles bring back lovely memories. I used to do that a lot in Pokemon. Anytime you saw bookshelves, you would you would read it. I guess there's not as much reading opportunities in this game, and they're just kind of giving a callback, is what it feels like. Alright, lady. If I make it up on the stadium's big screens during the finals, then the whole world will know my face. I mean, sure, also, let me... Yeah, I can't read the books. Just like how you put that one thing in the trash can and now I'm compelled to check all trash cans? I clean so that I can properly appreciate the beauty of flowers. Oh, all right, well, again, more power to you. The truest evolution for Pokemon is, I believe, becoming part of a team of true friends as they live together and grow close to humans. It's an applin and uh, this squirrel's gonna eat it. Good luck with that. Your your Pokemon are okay. Good luck. There's a lot of houses. Hello. The champion's been a great boon boon to trainers. Been a great boon to trainers. That's a new phrase that I t literally don't know what it means. The sport has really taken off thanks to him. I I really don't understand what you mean by boon. Plenty of trainers see his matches and get fired up, thinking I'd like to be like him. It's like a global festival whenever the tournaments or the Champion Cup are on. Pokemon and people in Pokemon come from all over. Okay. Last house. And it's a little girl. My mom and dad both work for the league. They're always away for the Champions matches, and it's well boring here on my own. Aww. I'm sad that you're by yourself. That sucks. Your parents should be here. <laughs> Not that I can't do anything about it. Oh, hello. Excuse me. I've got my eyes set on white on stadium. Okay. At least... Wait! There must be at least one ninja. I, I don't understand this comment. I, if you understand this, sis, let me know. But I have literally no clue. Ninjas. In England. Ha. Ha. Flying lost in Lydon's winding streets, use the city's dedicated flying taxis or the monorail. Oh, I can go into the... It's a park. Unless it's cute. And you can go in certain areas. The closest thing we have to, like, a forest. Grassy seed. Okay. Rare candy, that's nice. Can't do that, we gotta go round. We gotta go round. Nothing over here. I was gonna say, there's a couple people over here that I ignored. I'm going for a picnic with my Pokemon, and then two old ladies. Exactly, my Growlithe lost so much weight! Running a full circle around White on certainly burns a lot of calories. Calories. I read that in the wrong order, didn't I? Raihan likes to use Sandstorm first. I'll use my speedy Pokemon to defeat any Pokemon that try to change the weather. Moves that only select Pokemon can learn, they are called ultimate moves. Do you want your Pokemon to learn one of them? Which Pokemon? Liza can learn one? Do I have any other? Charizard and the bunny. And the rabbit. Huh. 
Hydro Cannon. The user can't move on its next turn. That's a dang powerful move. I don't really use Tearful Look that much. I don't know if I want to do that. Yeah, we're going to say no on it. Fair enough. Wow! Okay, I'm definitely going to come back, sir. Ball Mushroom. I can sell that for lots of moolah. And then that really seems to be it. That seems to be the entirety of White on a City. And there's the view of the stadium. I'm, I'm going to go ahead into the stadium just to see if something happens. Well, I'm going to heal first just in case if I have to battle again. Yes, please take them. Um... Leon Leon, the greatest champion ever. Leon Leon, will he be beaten? Never. What about you, lady? My sister just keeps singing Lingon's cheering song. Charizard's Max Flare is different from any other Pokemon. I won't lie, I started cheer cheering for Leon because my child is a huge fan. That's okay. Welcome, Challenger. Please battle to your heart's content. Welcome to... Oh, okay. So, let's go ahead in. I just want to see if anything happens. Anything big. And then I'm... Wow, this place is huge. Pop smiling. She made it this far, huh? It's Challenger Sora. This is the reception desk. This is the reception desk. Turns out I was the first to register for the Champion Cup. In other words, I'm already number one. It's pretty much in the bag that I'll win this thing. <gasps> my girlfriend! Hello! Look, we're kind of matching. We're polar opposites. Oh my goodness. I love the pink and green combo here. What is happening? Okay, this is it. I've really made it. I made it to the gym challenge. There might be four remaining in the semifinals, but I'm the only one who's gonna win through and battle the champion. Okay, you're a little cute Pokemon that I hate battling. I feel like Challenger Sora has a balanced team, but she doesn't have any way to decisively win, you know? Rude? I guess the champion's going to extend his winning streak again. You! Challenger Sora, remember, the semifinals and finals are just speed bumps on your way to facing Leon. You have to win. Well, your Pokemon evolved. Good for you. It's the ball guy. Who are you on the inside? Ah, Pokeball Monster! What kind of Pokemon are you? How do you do the things you do? <laughs> what kind of Pokemon are you? Oh gosh, it's still... Isn't that just creepy? Gosh, okay, one last time. Marnie. Yes, Marnie, 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 Marnie. Believe in me, can you believe in me? Do you believe in me? Thanks, all right, I can do it, I can do it. Hey there, thanks for rolling by to have a chat with your mate the ball guy. I can tell you're following your dreams and that means you've guessed it and I've got a Pokeball for you. Oh gosh, please, let it be over. A dream ball, wow, thanks, let me run. Please let me mind, your picture's already up there on the wall. Yeah, you yeah, sure, sure, Pokemon or a sleeper, easy to catch, but did you ever want it to be even easier? Well, the dream ball will make your dreams come true. Everybody needs some new it's full of surprises. Oh my goodness. Marnie, I did it, praise me. Thanks, I love you too. Oh, Hop, I did it. I, I'm, that guy is terrifying, right? Hop, I can't believe this even happened. Sora, correct? We've been watching over your performance in the gym challenge. This is just a formality, of course, but I'll need to check your gym badges if you don't mind. Mm. Baby couldn't make it, hard luck. Oh, somehow I didn't think he'd just take being disqualified lying down. You know what I mean? I haven't checked on him, actually. I guess it is what it is. Come on, Zora, we should head to the locker room. Oh, yeah, it's, they're definitely going to start me over. Okay, so hold on. We're actually... Ha-ha! <laughs> 
surprise! And now you know that it's 2.37 a.m. in the morning and I'm doing this. Wow, I should totally be asleep. So I closed off because I don't want to start there. I want to probably go back to the wild, do some more Pokemon things, and then record me uh, playing in the semifinals. So that's it for this video. That's all I'm going to show you. It's probably going to be a little bit until I record again. So if you... If I tell you that it's been a long time, it's been a long time. Just trust me. So I'll talk to you later, sis. Love you. Bye.